Sports, eh? Arriving from the right hand side, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it gives me great pleasure for our final year to present the Royal Air Force 2019 Ducano Display. <laughs> That distinct noise you'll hear throughout the display is the uprated Garrett TPE turboprop engine fitted to the Royal Air Force Tucano by Shorts in Belfast. This particular engine boasts more power than the original Tucano design. Liam now returning back towards crowd centre from the left. You'll see him roll the aircraft through 720 degrees in his five-point roll. And the team's thanks go out to them for helping us to make this the year's display possible. As Liam dives down for some energy, he'll be pulling up to the start of a loop where he will peak upside down at a height of 2,300 feet. pilot, as I've already mentioned, is Flight Lieutenant Liam Matthews. Liam is known in the military as a skimmy qualified flying instructor, meaning he demonstrated above average flying ability during his flying training and was selected at an early stage to become a flight instructor. As Liam pulls up, he's nodding to the left, to the right, and he'll dive back down towards crowd centre to get some energy for a quarter clover back onto the display line. Display team would like to thank a few companies for their support this year. A special thanks go out to Brightlink, Mountain Equipment, and Osprey Europe. Both the display pilot and myself were training on this aircraft less than two years ago. For the younger members of the audience watching, we remember watching our first air shows. We were not long ago in your shoes, and you could soon be in ours. As Liam now positions from the left hand side back towards you, he's going to put the aircraft onto its side and push around the sky in an outside turn. During this manoeuvre, Liam is being pushed out towards you by a force equal to twice his own body weight. If you've managed to visit our team tent already today, you'll notice another supporter to our team is the Royal Air Force Benevolent Fund. The team gives huge thanks for their support and enjoys celebrating together 100 years of the Royal Air Force Benevolent Fund. The Takano, now at the end of its service, has served 30 years with the number one flying training school, the oldest military flying school in the world. As it finishes its final year of service, the Texan T-1 aircraft is working up to replace the Takano as part of the new UK military flying training system and will fly out of RAF Valley in North Wales. Demonstrating a high level of handling skill, Liam will now complete a slow roll as he passes in front of you. This is one of many manoeuvres taught to all students as they progress through basic fast jet flying training and this teaches young aviators the handling skills required to appreciate the complexities involved when dynamically manoeuvring an aeroplane. Both Liam and I flew uh, during our time as air cadets and during our own military flight training. 
Now the UK military is working up brand new aircraft as part of the new UK military's world-class flying training system, UK MFTS. As Liam runs away from the crowd, I'd just like to give a big thanks to mine and his families who are here today with our partners, and thank you for their support for getting us to where we are today. I'd also like to give a happy birthday to Charlie. As Liam now pulls around the sky, he is performing a maximum performance turn, pulling 4.5G. As he passes back in front of you, he'll be pushed into the seat with the force of nearly half a ton. This is another example of a manoeuvre taught to all students at BFJT, allowing them to appreciate how to fly an aircraft to its maximum performance. Liam is now positioning to perform a favourite manoeuvre of Takano display pilots, the hanging stall turn. As he pulls up, the aircraft will appear to hang in mid-air in front of the crowd at a height of 2,500 feet, before Liam will recover and dive for some speed for his next manoeuvre. Ladies and gentlemen, keep your cameras panned on the aircraft as he appears to hang at the peak of his stall turn. Liam joined the Royal Air Force directly from university and I joined the Royal Navy after my A-level studies. Now, fairly early in both our military careers at the ages of 27 and 24, we have the opportunity to operate as a display team here today. If you keep an eye on the aircraft, Liam is now approaching the end of his display and will be dipping his wing one final time as he passes by the crowd. Give him a wave, ladies and gentlemen, he'll be looking out for you. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's been a pleasure to talk to you today and I hope you've enjoyed watching the display as much as Liam has enjoyed flying it for you. We hope you enjoy the rest of your day here at Cosford and we look forward to meeting as many of you as we can at our team stand located in the RAF village. Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, catch